Hello everyone, my name is Jeff and for maybe the next six to eight minutes, I'm going to go over a very um, important aspect of the Formula Z11 Pro Max or Formula Devices and that has to do with data syncing or refreshing the content on the device. If this is your first time to one of our uh, channels, whether it be the Stream Machines YouTube channel, a Rumble channel or Odyssey channel, wherever you're finding this device. Thank you, thank you, thank you for tuning in. Uh, we're not, probably not the best, but we're just going to stay consistent enough to bring some great content uh, day after day, week after week, and month after month. All right. So this this device is called the Formula Z11 Pro Max, and one of the benefits of it on any formula is the way you can refresh some of the data or content on the device that you're using now there's different steps or processes to be able to do that effectively and since we're on the formula z11 pro max we're going to show you some of the benefits what they've added so if you're in the middle or you have one of those older devices you might want to upgrade to the z11 pro max and don't start listening to people saying that there's buffering and there's bugs there are no bugs in the machine. I use this a lot. So half of my videos on our YouTube channel is about the Z11 Pro Max. So the first thing you're going to want to do is go to My TV Online 3. When it opens and you get a channel like AccuWeather, you want to hit the menu button and go down to Content Manager. Once you do that, you're going to go down to Data Sync or Data Sync right here where it says you can manage options for refreshing content lists and EPG data. EPG stands for Electronic Programming Guide. So one of the things that a lot of our customers or some of the people I've seen online, they complain about because they can't find certain content that they might have on their device and they don't know how to refresh it. Well, with the Z11, you would go to Data Sync and now you can right where it says Contents Data refresh contents now if i push over here and press the refresh button i'll update all the lists all the data that i have put on my device my device legally and that should do it right there another thing if you want to is where you can manage your electronic programming data you can use the buttons below to manually update and clear the data just like any device um, whether it be your router and modem I don't know if you do it, but if you use it a lot, which we all do, it's always best every 30 days to unplug it completely and let it boot up slowly and refresh everything in it. That is the same concept here. These buttons will give you options to either update the EPG, clear the EPG, or do both, clear and update the electronic programming guide. This way, if your guide is not showing correctly, doing one of these options here should fix it, hopefully. And it always depends on where you're getting your content. So I know where we get ours, and I'm very confident in that fact. Here's where the barbecue sauce goes on the chicken, okay? Auto update settings. This is powerful. Why? Because now you can schedule your data refresh daily. And what I mean by that is that you can have it set up automatically at a certain time of the day. If you leave your device on standby, you can schedule a refresh at 5 a.m. in the morning, but you just leave your device on standby. All right. That way, every single morning at 5 a.m. your time, your device will automatically refresh the whole device. So when you do wake up in the morning, you should be able, or God willing, we do wake up the next day. We should have everything as accurate as possible on your device. Second thing, automatic update settings. You can set intervals to refresh the EPG data regularly, choose days to keep the EPG data, all right? So babe, you can update the interval every three hours and the data is for seven days. If I click that, I can go longer, but by default, it keeps all the data 
in the guide for a seven day period. And every three hours on my device, it is going to update. This is one of the most powerful features on the new Formula Z11 Pro Max, amongst other things. Now, if you have an older device that you've bought from us, maybe an Alpha, maybe a Neo, maybe a Z8, and you want to update to this, we recently got 50, almost 60 of these units just for upgrades and just for Black Friday. But I wanted to make this video that, to show you some of the benefits of the Z11 Pro Max. Now, moving on as we get closer to the end of the year, I want to invite you to take a look at these devices. I have 50 to 60 of them, and I'm willing to make a deal, a reasonable one, so you can find out more about theboxman.com. Our website is www.theboxmen.com. Now, on our website, we do not have the Formula Z11 Pro Max yet. Um, I've been waiting to update our website before the end of the year so I can put all of our products, all of our services, everything that we do on one website and not on three. With that in mind, if you're interested in learning more on how you can upgrade or even purchase the new Formula Z11 Pro Max at a very discounted rate, let's make a deal. Let's meet in the middle. And I, I'd love to have you guys as a customer. Uh, we have some of the best tech support and customer support in the business. We do a pretty good job of just meeting you in the middle, not holding your hand, but teaching you how to fish or how to stream. So whether you stay with us at the end of a term, you'll know what you're doing. With that said, go ahead and, if you're interested in getting an upgrade, just go ahead and text us or call us at the number below in the description, okay? Or if, and leave a message and one of our associates will get back to you right away. But as we get closer to the end of the year, we want to strike a deal with as many people as possible. So share this video with someone that you care about who want the best of the best. And that's the Formula Z11 Pro Max. Have a great day. If you have this device, go ahead and check out the data sync and put your comments below.